What's up guys? Another update day, Friday video. It is 9 p.m. I know that's not late, but for me it's late because I wake up at 4 a.m. Brain dead video. Let's do it. Let's get it out. Alright, so uh, changes. So around home, some of the NPCs that don't have options have been removed. Uh, some easy examples would be the NPCs that usually sit around the teleport platforms. Uh, some of the in other NPCs... There's not, there's not too many of them, but, like, you know, it, if they didn't have any options at all and they were just kind of there to distract people and confuse new players, then they served no real purpose. So, uh, it might look like there's less people, but that's why. Uh, the Titans' achievements have been uh, nerfed or changed or lowered or whatever. Agile is now 50 laps. Hell's Kitchen is now 2,500 raw food. And Hunter's Vision is now 200 implings. I'm kind of skipping past some of the little ones. Again, if you want to see the full list of changes, I will have the link in the description below. Jokers now have some additional drops. They now have the Bond and the Elite Mystery Box on their drop table. This is the Joker Champion, I should specify, not the uh, normal Jokers. If you have $25 donated, you can now use the command EL to get to the Emerald Lounge. There's just a faster way to get here instead of having to, you know, go to the do Donator Zone and then run through the ladder. There is now a Forester here, which can teleport you to the Teak Mahogany area. Uh, there's also a Sand Pit here. A Bank Chest is here now. And then there's also the Sawmill Operator, so really good spot now for sand or collecting Teak Mahoganies. Another update with the event is the... Uh, or not the event, the... Another update with the... Up the dude, I told you, my brain is fried. Shut up. Uh, so... From now, donators will start fight caves in the Inferno at different waves. So Zenites will start basically at Jad, and then they'll start at wave 60 out of 69 on the Inferno. You can see these numbers here. Again, this will be in the description below. But uh, yeah, you'll basically start the, the waves much higher if you're uh, a, a donator. Basilisk, Basilisk, Basilisk Knights have been added. You can buy the V sigil from the Adventure Point shop, and then if you go southwest, and then buy a mirror shield from Neve, you can make a V shield. It's just an upgraded version of the mirror shield. It has the same stats as old school, but I did give it four or five strength bonus. I can't remember which one, one of those. But all you gotta do is go teleports, dungeons, basilisk night caves. See if there's anybody here. Surprisingly, there's not. And you are good to kill them. These things drop the basilisk jaw, which helps you make the uh, the neat's not face guard thing. So that's pretty cool. Two new additions to the in-game donator store. We have pet mystery boxes, and then we have adventurer's approval. So if you examine this, it just grants you 5,000 adventurer's points. Adventurer's... Is that spelled right? It looks wrong, but I don't know. Maybe it's not. Uh, pet mystery box. These are all of the possible pets you can get right now. These 16. I'll open, like, a couple. And you can, I don't know, see what pets I get. Lazy Hellcat. Wee. Did I? What's, who's my follower? Oh. Omelet. Duh. I forgot about you. Uh, Radioactive Cat's a fun one. E, e, jeez, jeez. Yeah, it doesn't. Yeah, I did uh, laziness. Laziness is the answer to that question. Uh, so yeah, that's fun. Pet mystery box just gonna be kind of a random fun thing that we'll have. Probably chuck in a couple other random pet stuff. The days, the years, all that fun stuff. There's also two new donator bo bon bundles on the web store. This is what's in them. If you want to glance at that. I tell you, man, I'm always fried at the end of these videos. <laughs> uh, what's uh, anything else? Anything? Else? Oh yeah, one one new invention was added today. The gemstone transmute. We trash. That's probably not enough money. Damn it. Gemstone transmute. Ah, I spammed random number and a son of a bee. Gemstone transmute. Requires 80 invention. This is the stuff. So basically, it lets you make a Zenite if you have four Onyxes. If you, uh, one Onyx if you have the Dragonstones, etc., 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 etc. 
that's basically it for the update. Uh, there's you, there's now a, a, a good chunk of stuff was added to the disassemble list for clues. Big shout outs to Extinct for adding those things. Uh, he's going to probably work with us a little bit here and there on some random stuff. Anyways, thanks for watching. Bye. Brain is dead. I'll have a better video tomorrow where I'll sort of talk about... Uh, I'll have a better video. And thank you to this dude for reminding me I forgot to talk about one of the better things that was added in the update. Fuck, I cannot remember. Fire Max Cape Adam. Uh, okay, so... Come to Conco If you've done all of the achievements, which I don't think I've done. Have I done them? I guess I did do them. Nice. So if you've done Agile, Hunter's Vision, Hell's Kitchen, and... Titan's Trial. That one. That one. All four. If you've done all four of those and you've maxed and you come over to a loon and you yes please it, you get yourselves a Titan Max Cave, which is, you know, it's basically the exact same stats as the the Fire Cape, except it has plus two prayer bonus. So it's basically just a, a better... Not necessarily a better looking because that's subjective, but it's yellow black titans cape matches well, blah blah blah, fun times happening. Alright, bye, ending of video. Bye.